Oh yeah. Dry grease. Yeah. Yeah. Alrighty, welcome back. As you can see, Doug's inside the car having fun. Um he had to get in it and see if he liked boom, it. Boom. And I'm thinking that he's happy with you. Happy with it, Doug? Yeah, I'm not getting out. <laughs> The seats in it and that stuff. Um, Nathan did the, the shifter and got the seat going on. Doug is actually, it's a big day today because we're getting a lot of stuff done. We want to get done. Uh, Doug is applying the window and uh, getting that put in there. Um, he cut it out yesterday. Uh, he drilled the holes yesterday. And today he's drilling the holes again and applying it to the frame that we put in there. Uh, basically, that's all I need for right now. That's all I want. That's what we're doing. Um, the red and all that stuff is looking good. You want to come take a look at this? We got we got a fan uh, that's in on the red there, so we'll get air through now and pull good. Doug's racing as we talk. That thing shifts wicked. It's just better than my car. Excellent. And that's on the same transmission, pretty much. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. So we got the fan on the front, or Nathan and Doug put the fan on. Got the red hoses on. Everything's going good there. The grill and the lights are sitting over there. Haven't really. I'm just waiting for this stuff to get dealt with, putting the fan on that stuff, had to come off. So basically, it's going good. Like there's not much room in there, but it all fits. It's just enough, you don't need that much. So Doug is doing the window, he's going to go back at that. He's doing a fantastic job, and I'll tell you why. Because it has not broke yet. <laughs> fantastic. He's only got- Knock on some wood or something, whatever they do, that superstitious stuff that I don't believe in. Anyways, Nathan is out here. He's ordering bearings right now. He's making a steering column for it. Uh, I plucked the steering wheel off this this morning because the steering wheel was too big for the car. So this will be the wheel that we're using. This wheel was a gift from a guy I met in the New Minus liquor store. Um, I was in there at the liquor store. He said, I have something for you in the car. And I said, right on. So I walked over with him. He gave me the steering wheel. And I, if he's watching, thank you very much. We're going to use it. You know what I mean? Like, it's cool. That's but anyways, yeah, this is the awesome. steering column that was out of um, the 40. And uh, Nathan right now is trying to get a bearing to put up through here to go on that shaft so we can put it in the car. So basically, uh, the windows will be done for hopefully today. Um, uh, hopefully the window gets done today. Um, Nate is doing the, the steer, making the steering column right at the present moment. As you can see, we have the fan on, the hoses are run. Uh, let's take a look in here. Got the shifter on. Uh, it fits really good. It fits really good. It's quite comfortable to sit in. Jolene, will you sit in it? Too dirty? Too dirty. So what we'll do is, um, yeah, what I'm doing is, is I'm putting the tail lights in, and basically I'm just putting a, a tail light in it that, I just want to fill the hole here. Actually, I've got a hole here. Must have been for the <coughs> gas door. And um, I, I'm trying to find some tail lights to put on it. I had this thing here. Um, kind of would have stuck off it a little bit. Probably would have been fine. Could have a license plate, but I have these 50 um, Pontiac taillights, or 48, whatever it was, the 48 Pontiac we did. We chopped a four-door, made a two-door. Them are the taillights out of it. Um, what I'm trying to do is to make it fit this gas hole. And what I did to the first one, taillight, is I took uh, the zip cut, and I cut that, as Jim would call it, monkey metal. And I just made it so it would flush, or mount flush, on the on the car just to put a tail light in it's just to fill that hole i'm not sure what we're doing with the gas um gas tank yet I'm not sure if we're going to buy one or if we're going to build make one and the reason being is the cost and the and the value of the metal and the, to make one that sort of deal stuff eh um so what i've got going on here i'm thinking this tail light will fit in but it's not flush mounting for me because i haven't got enough metal cut out i don't want to do that i didn't want to do that I haven't got enough metal cut out. So what I'm going to do is, let's, let's do this. I'm going to pull this off for a second. Uh -huh. See if I can get this flush fit. It will, but there's that ring around there. It'll look good enough, I guess, uh, to make myself happy. And that's all I need, something to, something like that. It's different. I need that hell of a ring. I need to cut that ring out. Let's do that. I'm not sure how I want to do that. Like a zip cut and a jigsaw, plasma cutter. <coughs> die zip grinder. Cut it, zip cut it is. What's that? Die grinder? Just a lot to die grind, you know. I want that whole. Get as close as you can with your zip cut and die grind it open. I think, I think that's what I'll do. 
not really up to that, but I'm going to do it. So Jolene's just going to walk around, film everybody what they're doing, and uh, we'll go from there. Welcome back. Thanks for coming back. Appreciate it. Put Go on, on the there. website, buy some shirts. They have really nice ones. Look at this one. Yeah. Promote, 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 like that, right? Yeah. Soon there's going to be one with my face on it. I guess we'll go with the die grinder after that, but not a bad cut, not too bad. Let's get a die grinder. How are you making it, Doug? Great. Great. Fantastic. Every screw is sketchy. Every screw is sketchy. Every screw is sketchy. Die grinder. Here's what it is. How'd you make out, Maple? Pretty good. Almost terrible. Oh, okay. Um, like die grinder. See the die grinder, anyways? Anybody? Anybody? I see the die grinder. Die grinder. I see it. I hung it up where all the other air fools. There it is, right there. Really on there had it. Close by. We're getting very close. Uh, we're getting very close. Um, we have not got brake shoes for the front, and the reason being is we got the wrong one sent. Uh, basically, once the steering column goes in, uh, there's a gas pedal. I have to put that piece in the floor. Uh, what else? Like uh, the exhaust. We have to do something with the exhaust and a gas tank. Probably the most important thing a gas tank. I've not got a gas tank yet, but uh, we'll get there. Yeah, more. Ah, let's see that thing again. Why is that seem like this? Oh, we're inside there. Inside there. Just want to make sure I buzz off the right, the right thing. That's all. Down. Probably just right, I guess. Gotta scoop some more out. It's awful noisy, isn't he? Yeah. 
terrible. Take some more out of it. <laughs> Gotta be careful because next thing I'll know, I'll be putting a patch in it. <laughs> <laughs> How's it going? We're just saw your place and we are fans. Oh, cool. Okay. <laughs> Not at all. Yeah, we're just all busy working. Yeah. yeah. Man, you're noisy. Just trying to do what I got to do. You're doing a good job, buddy. Got to get in there a little bit further. Where are you from? Just left the job. Okay. Hi. She's friendly. Oh, she's not even barking, is she? She's so quiet today. She's quiet. Why? Okay. I'm gonna say that's close enough. Oh, I got a little spot there. I hope that's right. Okay. There. That makes me happy. That makes me happy. Way better. Way better. Way, way better. Now. Happy with that. And um, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take uh, that pattern there and I'm going to apply it to a piece of paper. <laughs> and then we'll, we'll do this. How are you making it, Doug? Great, bud. Great, great, great. Awesome. I hope. Man. <clears throat> And the reason I'm taking this pattern here, because I want to take it over and put it. We got two, we got two tail lights. And then I need a pattern for the other side. And this will be my pattern. It's always good to have dirty fingers. Isn't it? It's always good to have dirty fingers. Rarely ever clean. If you're making patterns with paper, that is. Hey, there. Anything yeah. else is probably not. That I know. Fantastic. I was rubbing my hands all over Nathan and make them dirty so I could do that. <laughs> I got great big boots on, and generally, how I get in a hot rod is ass first. I used to put my ass in first and knock my head down. But anybody can get in any way they want to. But you really can tell how comfortable <laughs> this car is going to be. I like know, it's, right? It's quite comfortable. This probably one of the most comfortable. Cars we have. You might want to road drive it. Yeah, it looks, it's pretty and, nice. Uh, you're going to have to do more work to it's it to make nice. it that way. <laughs> it's pretty nice. Jolene's going to really love this car and want to road drive it every day. We're soon, we're soon going to have to get moving though, because we got other things that we want to get on to. Doug has stripped the Volvo, stripped all the metal off the Volvo, or all the paint off the Volvo. Um, it looks, it looks like a car with no clothes on. Yeah, pretty all much. All the paint's off it. Um, but we want to get started at that uh, and the owner, you know, but I really would like to finish this one so it runs, moves and dries obviously. Uh, but we'll get as far as we get with the parts that we have and if anything we have to wait for anything we'll move along. We have the 40 sitting there, the chassis all sitting there. That has to be, um, the pieces have to be nailed down that Doug has made and then going, 
going for it and uh, you know it's going to be a half a half a job but we obviously done it to this one we can do it to to that one there's my pattern that i need for the other side there it is so i'll keep that over there i'm going to put this tail light in right now at the present moment i'm hoping that still I suppose it has a special way to go on. If that's it, it's, there's a special. Yeah, there is a special way for it to go on too. Well, put the tail in like this. Here we go. There we go. Why is that not? Ah. Is that hitting the floor? I wonder. Never thought of that. The taillight could be hitting the floor because the floor is coming down. I'm not sure. I'm hoping not. That would be nice. Probably not the best thing. Never even thought to look at it. But it is what it is. That's what happens sometimes. Nope, we're hitting the floor. It's the wires are making it be not happy. Where is that? Fit the best at. Fit better before, didn't it? Didn't sound good on Doug's half, did it? <laughs> Doug laughing. Yeah. Didn't sound good. What you're drilling into behind all this stuff is the sketchy part. It's the sketchy part, bud. This should be deep enough for a screw. Come on. Sketchy, rusty it. stuff you're drilling into. It's iffy, iffy, iffy. But your screws aren't that long, so. Right? They all look pretty good except for that one right there. I don't like that bugger right there. He's a little, eh. You know, but. Just say, there like, you you drill the hole in, what's, what's behind it determines which way that thing's gonna go, right? We got some rusty behind this nice, clean frame. <laughs> Try not to turn them too tight. She, she goes snap, she's done. Now I gotta do it all over again. Maybe, <laughs> maybe, maybe. Joe will be like, no, <laughs> don't. <laughs> no, don't. <laughs> we'll see what do it all over again. This piece here has to fit through there. So basically, just I got this by put this piece back in. And I put it up there, it fits through there. We need to get a little bit more room on this side. So we'll just die grind a little bit more on that side. Once we get that to fit through, then we're good. Sometimes 
sometimes I go in where it is. Should you use a wrench on that? I don't. <laughs> this one here is already messed up or something or other going on. Uh, bad boy. That's the bad boy. I guess. Open up the wind that all the way in. Probably if we could put the nut on the outside and put it on probably. Get it close anyways. And that little sucker there should clamp on to that and to the car I'm hoping. Let's make it a little bit closer. Doug having fun? I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> I have to. I need a light. That's so good. I'm gonna borrow Nathan's light. So or we have a small good. light here. <laughs> what you looking at, Doug? I'm looking at the windshield. Are you happy with it? I'm happy with it. Good. You know, if this was a car I was driving down the road, no, I would not be happy with it. If it what? If it was a car I had to drive down the road every day, no, I wouldn't be happy with it. Why? Because it's plexiglass. I'll get 10 feet down the road, hit a raccoon, and it'll come through the windshield. No. <laughs> raccoon comes through the windshield. <laughs> Trash panda right in your face. Oh man. Aha. Uh -huh. Just like Doug said, aha. Uh -huh. Put them glasses on. Hey, bud. Hey, hey man. Huh? What's your phone? Spatula? Spatula. <laughs> What's going on with the junk here? <laughs> you know what that is? We need it's a that. sign that's burger time. Oh, it's burger time. Cheeseburger time, Nate. Good. Good. Okay. Down here would be fantastic. <laughs> wow. Well. while to get that turned up what should be. <laughs> How's it look, Doc? Looks pretty good, buddy. I like it. I like it. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Yeah, looks good. Yeah, did you guys make any bets whether I'd break this or not? 
Uh, no, I didn't no. want to make any either. <laughs> well, why not? <laughs> I'd be like, you're going to break that. No, no, no. I just so, didn't so want to. Whoever's the winner. I didn't, I didn't want to jinx you, old buddy. Yeah, well, what happens, happens. If luck has anything to do with anything at all, I'm screwed. So. <laughs> That one right there might be a better one. Sweet, sweet. I'm happy. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. That's some hair to get off and on. That is. That part gets me every time, right? I break the drill bit off in there. So. Suck. Holy smokes. You give you a hand, pal. Holy you smokes. Know? That was a rough one. Some, some guidance. But I got it. One more tail light. Get tail lights in. Let's get tail lights in. Come on. Let's do it. Let's get tail lights in. Uh, where did the where did the zip cut go? Zip cut right here. Ooh, we're gonna see the steering wheel in it. The steering wheel is so cool. <laughs> Tail lights are going to be cool too. 48 Pontiac. Uh, I can hold it there for you for a second, I guess. It's supposed to hit the hook on there. What I did, I'm not I'm just, I'm just going to hold it. I'm not going to move it. Half decent so. width. I'm just, just cut it. It feels like it's supposed to hook into this. But it doesn't. How far can you go, right? Yeah. Yeah, that looks right. Um, how far over? How do you like that snow, man? Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's old school. <laughs> And then, then I'm gonna get you to come set in it. Okay. <laughs> Doug loves setting it. Doug be driving this thing for you now. Okay, I'm gonna right okay, let go of this thing here. Yeah, we'll pull that back in again. Okay. Yeah. Blown donuts. You're sitting there. How much spaces are from the door to the? So the door might close and hit on the steering wheel. To tell you the truth, man. Kind of looks like. Yeah, door hits on it. So it's got to be over. It's got to be. From that that mark. You see that mark? Mm -hmm. Mark. Right there. Where I'm not, I'm not just kind of holding it in place. Do you want to land it right in that hole there? I just want to get some 
Okay. Now, let's see how much room you got for, for between your steering wheel and the door and hand room. Looks pretty good. I'd get away with it pretty easy. I mean, I don't know what you're putting on here for an open and close handle. Not, not a pair of ice not grips. Not a pair of so ice grips. Room, like there's only no ice yeah. grips or nothing there. So if you're driving it, just pretend you're driving it. You have lots of room with your hands around the wheel and all that Does stuff. it need to make car noises? Yes. I do. <laughs> <laughs> Heart smash. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know, like, is it too no. high for your eyesight? Okay. I can see the windshield. It's above the... But, you know, that's a Jolene thing. She, know, a Jolene thing if we went down here like so... We, we have all the windshield, but I'm not Jolene. She's different, built different than I am. Space, that oh, not much. The <laughs> Thanks, Ben. From the cone to the dash, where we have it now. Just funny that. <clears throat> yeah, not that far. Between there, between the okay, column and your dash. There for a second, so I, I kind of want it right there, so it's uh, not in your view. That's where I'd, I would like it myself. Yeah, just getting a rough estimate here on a few things you're trying to do. I'm trying to do the same thing, just a couple rough estimates. That'll work. Um, you want a marker? I'm going to make a noise with the grinder. Is that okay? <laughs> I'll give you permission. <laughs> no, he's all right. I'm fine. <laughs> Second time goes. I like the good in the car. Do you like the wheel? What's your opinion as you're watching? Do you like the wheel in the car? I'm asking the people that are watching whether they like it or not. I like how the shifter is. I like everything about it, to be honest with you. But, you know, it is what it is. Some close to the steering wheel, though. <laughs> it is. As long as it don't hit, it's called race car. The steering wheel is close to the shifter, but that's the top rod. It's supposed to be close. I can't. I can get my finger in between it. It's all good. It's all good, he says. You ain't got nothing figured out yet, so. No, we're just in the configuration. Ah! Got it. The Nate figuration? Is that it? Jambles and What a great little light that is. Great. You got my headlight on, do you? Just the little light here that's the little blue on? Yeah, yeah isn't it? Isn't it? <laughs>
Nate's thinking out loud. You'll convince yourself eventually. Sometimes you gotta talk out loud. You know what you're doing. Yes. I'm about two inches in. Like, yeah, towards me. It's way. It's way. Uh, I can make it again if you like. You want to pass me the marker? No, no. Okay. Like where your hands are high is good. Put it back where your hands are high is good. I'm saying it's in and out. You, yeah, the line's good. towards me, so it's away from the dash here. Okay, so if I trim some off here, I'll still have extra. That's, a, that's what I'm wanting. If I cut some trim. off, I'm still going to have extra. Is what I want to trim, know. trim. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. We've got two tail lights in. Oh, the whole thing wants to come. They by. didn't quite fit. Um, Are you just. Yeah. But we did the bad Chad thing and we oh, made it. just going to leave it here? And the reason being is, um, it had a hole in there. I just wanted to cover that hole up. I'm not sure what I'm doing with that there yet. Maybe that can be something Sorry, different. Not, must, but all I did is I cut the edge off the covers. metal like, and flush fitted it. Really? Where well, it's not absolutely perfect. The shifter, right? This is what. It's pretty close. Doing a good job, mate. Looks awesome. This yeah. is what I will do. Yeah. Here we go. Touchy. Or did I put them glasses on? Glasses, right there. This is what I do after I have the tail light on. I'm not gonna do this. I can do, I actually I can do it. Sure I can. Let's do this one. Put that on there like that. Just leave a little bit of the chrome showing, or a little edge of the tape. Now I take some seam sealer and go seam seal around that and make my own gasket. Yes. That other Dodge car. Yeah. The other one that's rotted out pieces in it. Yeah. Um, how could I cut a piece of the column off in that? There's a bush and bearing thing in it. You want it? Yeah. Is that going with the car or are you selling it or are you keeping it? Or? Just cut it out. We'll just run some extension cords and go for it. Okay. Okay, I got a, I got a black. There's a black extension cord going to the to storage containers. Yeah. And then there's the yellow can store, store, uh, yellow cord around here somewhere. Okay, that's what I'll do. I'm gonna go. And... Yep. Right on. Cool. Need a hand. So we're buddy. we're doing it again. We're uh, Nathan's doing whatever he has to do to make it work. And this here, you know, I haven't got any real fine tape. I just put it on where I want the gasket. Not that I need a gasket, but just sh why not show what I do or what I'm going to do. Make it work. Probably just put it on there and just going to tape in that. Kind of rusty and that sort of stuff, but. We probably haven't got the right end for that, that's for sure. So what I'll do, I'm not gonna do it this second because I have to open up a new one, and I will after a bit. I'll just go around it, caulk it like that, rub it around with my finger, and get the best I can. I probably will try to get that tape in there so it don't get all over the car, but that's for another time. But we have two tail lights in it, or I might not even put a gasket in it, who knows. But that's how I can put a gasket in it. Let's put the trunk lid down. Like around the window, what Doug's doing after it's done, I'll probably end up making a gasket around it with seam sealer and just taping off the window and, and going around it so nothing nothing will leak. But I want to leave it this way until he gets it done so I can go along. I want to shave it down some more where it's not fitting a little bit. I can just knock it down a little bit. It's on the car now, so now I can hold it and sand it. If anything happens, it is what it is. Two tail lights are in. Doug's going for it, got the window going for it. Uh, Nathan's got the steering column going. All we have to do is just keep working, keep working, it'll come together. Uh, thanks for coming back, thanks for watching. 
I don't know how, how much time we're in on this bad boy, but uh, I'm, I'm, I'm impressed with, you know, how much Nate and Doug both show up and me working on it how fast we got it done or getting it done. And we're doing it with everything that's in the air. Like we're not we're doing other things in the meanwhile too. So that yeah, car, Volvo. Open today. Yeah. It's a big day for all of us. <laughs> Nathan got nuts and bolts. Yesterday he got a, he got a uh, drill press. Works now too. Huh? <laughs> Doug got a chance to cut windows and drill holes and be scared all the time. He's going to hurt something. Yeah, check you out. And you know what? I might even use it. I could see. Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably didn't use it. But anyways, everything's going good. Thanks for coming. And uh, subscribe. Throw in a comment. Throw in a like. But it's going straight forward. We're just one, one click after another. Just check it off off the list. And uh, we'll soon be moving her out. We got the skinny pedal down. We're at her. Skinny, skinny pedal, pedal down. Nathan says we're we're at her. Have a great day, everybody. See you later.